Hey, what's up, everybody? It's the Untouchable Wolf, and today I'm gonna show you how to craft. You see, I'm with my sidekick Rose, so say hey to her. What's up, Rose? Let everybody know that we're playing Monster Hunter World, and I'm gonna show you how to craft this goat. And look at Hero. What are you over there doing? All right, guys, let me know in the comment section down below what do you think about this game as you're watching. So there are two, and this guy, man, come on. All right, so there are a few different ways that you can craft. It's really easy, guys. You can craft on the go. I'm on the PS4, but uh, you want to hit up, uh, start up your uh, m menu, and then you see right there, you go to crafting list, and then you can craft on the go. You have your crafting list. This is everything that you can craft right now with the question marks. I cannot craft, and uh, as you play, you're going to unlock uh, different items that you, you can um, craft, and then you can um, see this is everything that I can craft, and then they have different categories. You have healing, support, traps, and offense. And then you have your ammo encoding. So this is the things that I can craft right now on the go. And I'm, I have different things in my item box. The item boxes are uh, stored in different places. I'm in my room. So if you go to your item box, you probably have a lot of more things stored. And you can craft in here too. So let's open up the item box. And then you're going to go down to crafting list. And there we go. Let's go to crafting list. This is everything that I can craft. So if you have any questions, uh, let me know in the, in the comment section down below. Now, I'm going to go down and go to, let's see what I would like to craft. Here I can craft a mega portion. And you see down there at the uh, below it, it says mega portion restores a moderate amount of health. And all you need is a potion and the honey. And you see uh, right next to the potion is 21. And then next to the honey to the right is two. Now that's how many of uh, items of each of the particular uh, per particular items you have in your um, item box. So I have 21 uh, potions and then I have two honey. So I got to get some more honey, guys. So I've just started the game. Uh, I have a lot of fun with it. So uh, once you uh, get your materials, you can also uh, auto craft by I'm hitting I'm on PS4. So I'm hitting the check mark. So whenever you get enough resources, you can you it'll auto craft. So um, that's pretty cool. But you want to be careful because if you find a rare item or some, a unique item, it's going to automatically <laughs> craft it. So make sure you pick and choose uh, very carefully what you ought to craft, guys. So let me go create this mega potion. And there we go. You see it now. I have one in my item box. I can actually go let's manage my items. And there we go. Put that up in there. There we go. Okay. All right. Wait. Hold on. I'm going to show you guys something too. It's really nice. Um, let me see. There, You can actually have up to 24 different things in your pouch, which is really, really cool. Oh, hold on, man. See if I can. There we go. You can, I think, only store up to a certain amount of uh, different, different items right there. So, okay. All right. So let's go back to the crafting list and see what else I can craft. Now remember, it's, it's they break it up into different categories. I have uh, it selected all, but here we go: healing support, traps, and offense. And um, down here, ammo coatings. I can actually create a, po a poison coating. But you see, down there below, it's an arrow coating, and it has a big red X on it. If you don't know what the red X means, it means that. You cannot apply this to your weapon. And the weapon I have is uh, the axe, which uh, transforms to a longer blade, which is really cool. I'm a big uh, Bloodborne fan. So, you know, I wanted to get that axe in. I'm going to show you some gameplay of that as well, guys. Make sure to subscribe to me because I'm going to be live streaming. We're going to have a lot of fun playing this game. So, uh, let's see. I'm not, you know, I'm not going to craft that because I don't won't be able to use it with my weapon that I'm currently using. But okay, I can craft poison meat, so that's really good. All right. All right, now I have two poison meat, and they, they're, they're going to get really messed up when they eat this, the, uh, the monsters, the dinosaurs. And all right, so if you have any questions, this is how you craft. Remember when you're uh, doing an auto craft, you want to make sure uh, you pick and choose because it's going to quickly uh, craft that item that you have checked. So. I want to, and I took some time. I want to take, make sure you guys will understand how to craft because I was looking online and there's, and uh, looking at trying to, I see there's not too much online right now when it comes to Monster Hurl, 
Monster Hunter world when it comes to crafting. So uh, guys, I hope this video helped you. And remember guys, if you have any questions, let me know and I will respond to all of your comments and we will learn this together. So it's pretty easy guys. Remember that you have your crafting list overall and then as you progress, things with the question marks you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna unlock and you'll be able to craft those too. All right, all right guys. But I do not want to craft recover M1 no. All right guys, so let me know your thoughts and if you do enjoy this video and found it helpful, please leave a, a like rating and subscribe to me if you're new. I really do appreciate it. And, and don't forget to say hey to my sidekick bros. All right guys, thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Later. Peace.